So last summer I spent two months in France working at a campsite and I want to say that it changed my life but to be honest I don't feel like there is just one moment in your entire existence that will change your life. Things do not just happen overnight, that would be way too easy. It would be cool, but unfortunately that is not how life works. When people say that their life changed overnight, I always feel like they are forgetting something. I feel like they are forgetting the decisions that they made before that night. That they are forgetting that with every decision you made, it was leading up to that one certain moment you feel like changed your life. And that's when you feel like your life changed overnight. However, when I say that this summer in France changed my life, I want to say that this summer I took a lot of steps in the direction of changing my life. This summer I decided to go out of my comfort zone and to try to grow into a better person. The kind of person that I look up to. The person that I see walking down the street and want to cheer on because she looks so cool. I chose to make some big steps towards the person I am striving to become. Because, at the end of the day, that's what we all want. We all want to become a better person. This goes to say that decisions are not always easy and there will be a lot of obstacles on your way. But the thing is, you don't have to overcome them all at once. Life has its way to divide the obstacles throughout your life. Sometimes days will be relatively easy and some days it will feel like everything just happens all at once and you just want to stay in bed and scream into your pillow and throw all your stuff at the wall. Sometimes I have days like that. <laughs> anyway, these obstacles, they can be anything. There can be physical obstacles. This summer I decided to go cycling while I was sleep deprived, dehydrated and it was 38 degrees outside. It was just a little challenging in the beginning but on my way back I was struggling not to faint at the side of the road because I was about to pass out. Obstacles can be scary. My friends and I went caning, or if that's how you say it. And I didn't really know what it was, so I just figured it would be fun to get to know everyone. And as some of you know, I am terrified of heights, and caning does indeed involve jumping off of heights. At one point, I had to jump off a 4-5 to five meter cliff, and I was just standing there for 15 minutes, watching the rest of the group jumping off with screams of joy, and I was literally almost peeing my pants. <laughs> But I didn't want to go around, because I knew I would regret not jumping off. So I did it, <laughs> with terrifying fear while screaming from the top of my lungs and people thought someone was getting murdered. The fact that I overcame that obstacle doesn't mean that the next time I see a 5 meter cliff I will run off with joy. I will probably still go around, but at least I did it once. Life will throw some emotional obstacles at you. Love, loss, and having to let go will be a part of that. You will lose friends, family, a lover, and maybe even a pet. People will betray you, and they'll be mean to you, and you'll feel like you're in a fucking Taylor Swift song, and that's okay. Because Taylor also wrote some pretty powerful badass songs, and maybe that one will be up next in your playlist. One day I was sitting at the river romanticizing my life, and I decided to delete the numbers of the guys I dated before I found my boyfriend. Those guys that, at the time, I did care for, I lost, and now finally decided to let go. I heard this quote in the film Pierrot le Fou, which is a French film about a man who just lost his job and feels unhappy in his marriage. 
at a party, he reunites with his ex-girlfriend and they decide to spend the night together. When terrorists chase the girl, he decides to leave Paris and his family behind and go on the run with his ex-girlfriend on a crazy journey. So the quote goes, I'll tell you something. There are 3,600 seconds in an hour. That makes about 100,000 seconds in a day. In an average lifetime, that makes 250 billion seconds. All in all, you and I have spent about one and a half months together. Add it up and I've only been with you a few million seconds out of the 250 billion that make up your life. It's not much, so I'm not surprised we don't know who each other is. So if you think about it, this summer has only been a teeny tiny part of my life and therefore saying it changed me is not really fair towards all the other experience that I've had and still will have in the future. Anyway, what I'm trying to say is, don't believe in one moment that changed your life. There will be a lot of them and they will all be different. You'll make a lot of decisions and as long as you believe in making the right one, you'll be changing your life every second just by growing into a better person than you were before making that decision. Even if you don't notice. And then it will feel like your life just changed overnight.